wanted in the shooting death of a young woman turned himself in today, but instead of showing up at the Greenville County Sheriff's Office, he called WYFF News 4, asked that a reporter witness his surrender. That reporter was our own Tim Waller, who is live and local at the Greenville County Detention Center for us tonight. Tim. Michael, what a surreal moment that was. Daru Smith, who's wanted in connection to the shooting death of Shamika Logan, Wanted to turn himself in, but he was worried how that might go down, so he called us up and asked him to meet him at the nursing home where his mother is a patient. It was uneventful, mostly. Daru Smith, the murder suspect, walked over to talk and answer a few questions for my iPhone. And what's your name? Just, I mean, I know who you are. Jaru Smith. You are Jaru Smith? Yes, sir. I asked him why he was turning himself in. He said he was doing it for his brother, who's also charged with murder. Are you taking the blame for this? Is that what you're saying? Yes, sir. He didn't do it. You, you didn't? Yes, sir. You, you, you shot the young victim? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, here they are. So, As you can see, Greenville County deputies walk in slowly and handcuff Smith. He is under arrest for the murder of 23-year-old Shamise Logan, who was shot and killed earlier this month. Smith, you've got a murder charge. Bond for Smith was denied by a judge. The brother of the victim spoke out at the hearing. Hill. Outside, Vashon Logan said the loss of his sister has been devastating. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. At least he says the man accused of causing that pain will now be held accountable. So tonight, Ja Ru Smith and his brother Bobby are being held right here at the Greenville County Detention Center, both charged with murder, both being held without bond. Tim Waller, WIFF News 4, live in Greenville.